Hey sellers, thank you for joining us today and welcome to our live session. I'm Ankita Patel working as product evangelist at Seller App and today I'm here to give you insights on how to get ready for Q4 with the best Amazon repricing strategies. Now Q4 is one of the busiest seasons for e-commerce sellers and B2C brands. Preparing for Q4 can be compared to preparing for a first date. We try hard to look good and be prepared, but nerves are unavoidable. After all of the anticipation, building commotion and preparation, this historic event is almost upon us. That is why I'm here to enlighten you all on all the necessary elements to prepare for the successful Q4 in 2022. And today we'll be talking about our next significant step of Q4 roadmap that is Amazon repricing. So uh, repricing is used by 60% of high profit Amazon sellers on a consistent basis. This depicts how important repricing is in terms of the selling point. Amazon changes every day, every hour and almost every minute. Things appear static and unmoving to the consumer. In reality, listings and prices are constantly changing. Repricing is becoming increasingly popular among Amazon sellers. They may reprice their items several times per day, making it difficult for other sellers to keep their prices current and competitive. It distinguishes these retail sellers and customers receive the same item at a lower price. Keeping your prices dynamic and relatively lower than competitors is a proven and effective strategy for expanding your Amazon market. Positive customer feedback which may help you win the coveted Amazon buy box. Now what exactly is Amazon repricing? The changing of prices on Amazon marketplace listings is known as repricing. On Amazon, approximately 2.5 million price changes occur per day. This implies prices on individual listings change every 10 minutes on an average. Most Amazon users will not notice these changes, but subtle pricing changes can cause a surge in sales or downturn for sellers. Dynamic pricing is a tried and tested strategy for expanding one's market. It helps you sell more and get good customer reviews, which can lead to winning the Amazon buy box, which allows your business to grow even more. Amazon repricing is more than just a passing fad. It is a requisite part of doing business on the platform. Now, what exactly is the need of Amazon repricing? Well, repricing is an excellent solution for optimizing your product prices and striving to maximize the conversion rate of your digital store. It is concerned with automating pricing op optimization techniques that suggest competitive prices when performing a competitive product analysis between your products and your competitors. Amazon repricing is much more than a trend. Consider the option of repricing all of the items in your store several times per day. Is it possible? Can you keep the track of all the real-time prices at once? No, right? But repricing tool assists you in performing all these tasks on an ongoing basis. These are few repricing options available. Using the right repricing strategy is crucial to achieve your Amazon business goals. Repricing strategies enable any business to streamline in operations, attract more customers and increase its return on investment. Now let's take a look at some major pricing strategies that will help your business grow. There are basically three types of repricing strategies. So the first one is manual repricing. So when there are only a few ASINs, most sellers manually adjust listing uh, prices in Amazon Seller Central, which is fine. However, as your company grows, it becomes more difficult to manage and control. It's also slow, tedious and prone to errors and miscalculations. And as a result, many sellers use repricing software to automate the process. The second one is rule based repricing. It gives sellers complete control over changing prices in response to competitors. Sellers have to manually create rules based on various scenarios and factors and tell the repriser how to price against competitors. You also set a minimum and maximum line uh, either for percentage or currency and then track the results. Once you are in the buy box, you can create rules to price lower or higher or match competitive prices, or you can decide to stay competitive or maximize profit. 
You can even narrow down the types of competitors based on fulfillment types and feedback ratings, etc. So the established rules will not conflict with one another and instead collaborate with one another. So if you don't have any matches against competitors, you can also set a rule that will maximize your price in order to make the most money from these products. The third one is algorithmic repricing. It is a far more intelligent tool that uses AI algorithm to determine the best possible price based on all the market conditions. It uses a wide range of metrics to analyze market trends and determine the price. It also takes into consideration the factors that influence a seller's chances of winning the buy box. AI algorithms predict pricing trends using machine learning. So the more of you reprice over time, the better price predictions and price optimization our algorithms can make on the price. Now let's move towards the benefits of algorithmic repricing. For the first one is increases your chance of winning the buy box. So clicking add to cart accounts for 90% of Amazon purchases. The Amazon algorithm who wins the Amazon buy box price, sales, volume, fulfillment type and feedback scores are all the factors. With algorithmic repricing, you won't have to worry about pricing. You will be customized to outdo your competitors at the lowest possible cost, taking into account the level of competition you face. Next is saves your time and efforts. Manually adjusting your product prices each time your competitors reprice their products takes a longer time. When you sell multiple products on Amazon, it becomes even more difficult to keep up with all the price changes, right? So algorithmic repricing can automatically adjust the prices considering all the factors to outperform your competitors. Next is increases efficiency. When you are sitting in front of the desk completely focused on changing prices, it's difficult to spend time elsewhere. So sellers can save a lot of time by not having to manually reprice their products on Amazon and can invest their time in other areas such as marketing and increasing sales. The next one is decreases human error. You are bound to make mistakes in business, no matter how careful you are. And you don't want it to happen in the pricing area because it could result in you earning less or losing sales. It is far beneficial to use a repricing tool whose primary function is to change your product prices and deal with the numbers based on information you provide and the rules you set. You won't have to move a decimal point because your repriser will do it for you without error. Next is increase in sales. When you offer competitive product prices, buyers will naturally gravitate towards you rather than other sellers. And as a result, you get more sales and more money. Next is ensures consistency across platforms. So inconsistencies across marketplaces and platforms are unavoidable when prices are set manually. Listings pile up, uh, listings go unchecked and mistakes happen. So this is serious for Amazon sellers because if they discover you are selling on a cheaper uh, product elsewhere, they will remove your listing. Repricing softwares automatically replicates your prices on other marketplaces where you sell. This ensures consistency across your product line with minimum effort. Next is access to vital data and insights. So repricing software can provide users with a wealth of useful information at a glance. These metrics cover everything you need to know for optimizing your repricing strategy from price movements to top competitors. You will even be able to recognize when a tailored strategy is required to beat the competition and win the Amazon buy box. Isn't it amazing? So this was all you need to know about repricing. So basically there is no secret formula for effective repricing strategies. However, the practice and experimentation, you will discover what works best for you. Test repricing strategies until you find what works best for your company and each type of product you sold. Determine your ideal competitor's specifications within a category and tailor your strategy to outperform them. Maintain your strategy once you have found a sweet spot. Also keep in mind, prices should not be changed arbitrarily as a result of an emotional reaction. Changing your strategies too frequently waste time and prevents you from remaining competitive. 
your best bet uh, is to go with the flow of competition now getting ready for q4 may seem daunting but if you follow these tips you will be ready to capitalize on the sales opportunities and that's all you need to know about amazon repricing thank you so much for watching this video i hope you found this video helpful it's your support that keeps us going if you want to see more videos on a specific topic leave them in the comment section below and we'll definitely create them for you while you prepare for this holiday season don't forget to spread the holiday spirit spend time with your loved ones and as always happy selling